Now this video is gonna be very graphic. So if you don't wanna see us butchering some meat rabbits, um, you need to get scroll on to a different channel. This is gonna be a very graphic uh, video. Um, there's the six rabbits right there. We're gonna be uh, dispatching them using the broomstick method. Um, we will hang them up on here by a hind leg to skin them and gut them and it'll fall into this trash can. And then we've got the uh, ice chest to put them in here to cool them down. And then we've got our uh, knife sharpener because I like to sharpen my knives during the time. And I've got a couple knives here um, that we'll use to help in the skinny. And we use this to uh, break the bones. And then we got a couple of uh, Ziploc bags because we're gonna keep the livers and the, the skins and the heads. Um, so if anybody's local, they want to get some, their raw dog feeder, they feed their dogs raw, I've got, I'll have some rabbit heads available if you want to feed your dogs raw. So this is the, the, the one rabbits that we're going to be butchering today. Make sure you uh, subscribe to my channel, click the bell notification so you can be notified when we upload additional videos and follow along the rest of the video. When dispatching rabbits using the broomstick method, um, it's basically spinal dislocation. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna set the broomstick on the ground, stick the rabbit's head underneath it, step on both ends, and then pull their hind legs up to dislocate their, uh, the dis for the spinal dislocation, and that, that puts them out of their misery, quick, easy, painless. So let me show you how we, we're gonna set it up. And you just pull Okay, now the rabbit has been uh, dispatched. So what I want to do is I want to cut so he can bleed out. So I'll take this knife. Let me do it this way. So you can see. So I basically want to cut his throat. So he can bleed out. And what I like to do to cut the bone, break the bone. And then take the knife. And then remove the head. And I'm saving these heads. So if you're local and you wanna buy some uh, rabbit heads for, your, to, for raw feeding your dog, Give me a call. Okay, the next thing we want to do is we want, we're, in order to skin them, we need to remove their legs um, and the tail to, to beginning the skinning process. So what I like to do is use these same clippers to just break the bone. On the legs. and then come back with the knife and then just remove the legs right where I broke them. See, rabbit foot. And then remove the tail as well. And then in order to start the skinning process, let me bring you a little closer. Okay. 
I'll just take the leg and pull the skin away from it a little bit and then stick this so I can start to get the, the, the skin away from the, the meat here. And I just start to pull down on it. See, it's starting to pull down. And then it should just peel right down. Like a sock. Just peel right down. Okay, so that now that's the, the carcass. So the next step, the next step is we want to gut it. So the rabbits have a bladder. You want to be careful that you don't cut that bladder. So what I like to do is just pull the skin away from the body. Let me get you a closer view. away from the body, stick a hole in it, and then stick my finger in that hole so I can make sure that I don't cut that bladder. Okay, this rabbit's bladder wasn't very full, but this is the bladder right here. So I grip it and then just cut it and throw that away. So now I want to just get all of these guts out. So I'll take the knife and then just go up from the chest part and just cut through. Try not to cut any of those intestines or anything, just cutting the, uh, the skin and now all the innards want to come out. This is the liver. We're saving that liver. So what we want to do is just start cutting. And pulling all, everything out.
There's the liver. We want to cut the liver out. And you see the liver? It has like a little bile thing here. You want to take that off. That you don't want. So we'll pick that off of here. Throw that away. And then we're going to save these livers because we, we're going to eat the liver. Okay, so now these are the kidneys. Some people eat the kidneys. Um, it's got some lungs still in here and the heart. So if you got a dog, you know, you can feed those to your dog. So we're just going to pick all this stuff out. Throw that away. And the next step is you need to cut the uh, the innards out because where you pooped out of, it, it's still in here. So you want to cut that out. So what I'll do, come this side over here and get a better view, is I'll just cut the meat on each side because there's a bone right there that we have to break. And I use my clippers to break that bone. And I stick it on each side and boom on one side and then boom on another. And now I can take out the, the booty hole. This is the boo-boo hole that had those, you can see the, uh, it still got some rabbit poop in it. So then I can cut that loose. You see? It's got some boo-boo in it still. Cut that loose. And now that's a cleaned rabbit. It's just gonna take a little bit more, you know, before I bag them up and, and stuff, I'll rinse them off. Um, and then the next step is just to cut this last leg off. So we break it with the clippers. We come behind it with the, the knife. And that is our butchered rabbit. We'll clean all this stuff up later, but that's our butchered rabbit. And now we just stick it in the ice chest and put ice on it. Now that's how you butcher a rabbit. That's how you butcher a rabbit. Quick, fast, and easy. Um, and then we got another rabbit's foot, rabbit's foot.